Hi, Peter Charles here for Fly Fly Fishing. And today I'd like to announce a, another fly series that I'm going to be doing, and it's going to be based on the Forgotten Flies book. Now what's interesting about this book, it has a great deal of streamer patterns in it. I can go for a long time tying patterns in, out of this book. It also has some Kerry uh, Stevens streamer patterns. And Kerry Stevens uh, was from the northwestern corner of Maine and produced flies uh, that was used all over the northeast of the United States uh, and particularly in the Rangeley Lake series. Now I've actually fished the Rapid River that comes out of the Rangeley Lakes and um, where we stayed was directly across the lake from Kerry Stevens uh, Cottage. So it's kind of, I have a little bit of an attachment to that history and I've caught brook trout on some of her patterns. So we're going to do two things basically. I'm going to do some relatively simple patterns uh, hair wings mostly. I'm also going to do some complicated uh, hair wing patterns as well. And uh, I've talked about using jungle cock in the past. Yeah, I'm going to drag out my jungle cock and use it. So it's going to be a sort of a mixed bag of both easy and more difficult uh, patterns. I'll also do one video just on how the wings get put together uh, for the Carrie Stevens uh, streamers because there's a particular construction technique. So instead of repeating that in every video, I'll do one video that shows the technique and reference that one from that point on. Uh, but I think it'll be interesting. Uh, it'll be a, certainly a different series. And I think it'll be, um, uh, you know, you can, you can still catch fish on these streamers, trust me. I did quite well with the, uh, the Grey Ghost in, uh, in Maine and caught a lot of uh, salmon, landlocked salmon and brook trout on them. So anyway, stay tuned. Uh, they'll start appearing in the next few days. And I'll start with some simple hair wings and we'll go on from there. So uh, I'm just kind of looking forward to this. Uh, be a change from doing all those steelhead patterns. Cheers.